Ah, so you've done it. You've learned scripting, but you don't know what to do. You don't have any game ideas. You don't know how to make your dream game and you cannot find anyone to give you a commission. This sucks. Well, I have the solution and this video is going to teach you exactly what you should do next if you've just learned a script. First, you know, you need to take a step back and realize this. You have done something amazing. You learned scripting on your own. This is really hard to do and very impressive. You should congratulate yourself for this and really realize that you have gotten a huge part of this out of the way and you've come really far. You are on the easy part now. So you should start out by just hopping into Roblox Studio, picking something from another game and making it. Remake it in your own way. Doesn't matter how simple, just remake stuff that you see in other games that you think is cool or remake a free model, remake something and make small projects, just elements of games. Don't make entire games, make projects, make systems, make different, different things that you can interact with. And no matter how simple, this is gonna help you practice when you start out. I mean, this could be even like a button on your screen. You, you wanna get that cool tweening effect where you uh, click in and it like sizes up and down and stuff. That was something I wanted to do when I, was start, when I started out, so I learned how. And it really helped me because I was able to do that in every other script really easily after that when I remembered how. So just go and figure out how to make small things like this and do it for fun. Doing this is rewarding and it'll show you how to make all the small details for your game. All right, after that, after you've built up your skills making these small projects half games or just unfinished stuff remaking stuff and just trying to improve in every way possible you need to pick the first true game you want to make drop everything that you're working on and start on this game once you're sure you can do it after you made some small stuff and you've learned the process needed to be able to learn whatever you want you will be ready to do this because learning to make all these small projects will help you learn that process of looking up stuff how to script this is crucial looking up stuff and being able to find what you need so that you can actually make it like most scripters they do not sit there typing out their code just straight out most scripters are constantly looking stuff up checking stuff so there's no shame in doing that but you got to learn the process so you can do this efficiently and quickly uh, so that when you're making your game you can do it really really fast and you can script well look up stuff as much as possible that is okay to do advanced scripters do it intermediate scripters do it beginner scripters do it do it. If you don't know this process, I'm going to break it down in the video in the top right hand corner so that you can start doing it now. You will be able to practice scripting and remember it with this process. It's going to be really helpful. But you're probably wondering where to start this game and what game do I even make if it can't be my dream game or a really crazy high quality game? Well, that's why I made the video on screen. It's going to show you exactly what game you should make right now for your first project. See you there.